This is Bumper to Bumper TV. Are small station wagons cool again? Volkswagen is betting with rising fuel prices that the Jetta Sport Wagon will be a hit in this country. Known as the Golf in Europe, the Sport Wagon comes with a familiar 2.5 liter five cylinder engine under the hood. This power plant is also the reason why the car is just being introduced now. There were some engine uh, supplier issues and with it being such a hot product in Europe, uh, they took precedent. So we had to give up some of those cars to Europe. But then also for us here in the States, Jetta is our number one volume car. So we had to take in whatever we could to put into Jetta. So we took some two fives that would have gone into the sport wagon into just the Jetta sedan. If the standard 2.5 isn't enough, enthusiasts can order the two liter turbo version for more power. Others can stretch out on the new sport wagon with a host of customization kits to individualize the car. But to get some more buzz on the vehicle, designers also came up with an optional panoramic moonroof. Now remember, this is a wagon with nearly 33 cubic feet of space with the rear seats up and more than twice that with the seats down. The interior is familiar with European sized space for drivers and passengers. So what's it like to drive one? This really continues the whole, um, if you want to get into the, the familiarity of the Volkswagen family. Uh, even though it's a wagon and the back is open, it's not any louder than a Jetta sedan. It doesn't drive any differently than the Jetta sedan, which is fantastic because there's the extra weight of the back, but it doesn't affect the way the car handles. For the record, a two liter diesel has also been promised for the sport wagon in the near future. The question now is, will American buyers wait for that or accept what's already on the table? This is Greg Morrison.